Hello, hi everyone, so welcome back to my channel, Elsa here. So today is gonna be another new episode for the Bestie Talk. So let's get into it. Alright, so for today's video, I'm gonna talk about the topic of like, you know, if you want something, make it happen, don't wait. This is something that um, I've learned in a hard way. Like, I lie. Okay, like a bad way to say it is like I wasted like two years of my life waiting for things to happen But then I realized that um, things doesn't move at all And it makes me think like life is unfair, when things gonna work for me, that kind of stuff Why my life is like this, when other people are getting what they want, achieving their dreams, why am I not getting anything that I want, right? So I literally like waited like two years, just follow the, in a way that I follow what people are saying, it's kind of like, hey, you have to be patient, wait for it, it's gonna happen. So I literally did that for the whole two years and I wasted that right um that's what i'm gonna say like i waited two years but of course those two years there's a lot of things that happen in a way that like um you've learned you've grown you see things differently um and there's a lot of like lessons i guess that you can take while in that um pause moment so this happened after master study so I got back home, I was trying to, you know, find a job, I didn't get a job and then I keep on waiting and waiting to get a job. Of course I did apply it, but I guess like it's not as as aggressive as it should be, not, it should be. So, and then one day I was like, you know what, nothing gonna come my way, like things are not falling from the sky for me, I have to make this happen. So I did make it happen and here i am in hong kong still after six years so um living abroad is one thing that i've that i've wanted for so many years ever ever since my study like my undergrad study like i really want to like go outside of malaysia so, you know connect with people and learn a new culture new languages and stuff I always passionate about like living abroad, right? But um, nothing sort of like worked my way. Even though I got a good grades during my study, it's not it's not good enough for peop for the for me to get selected, you know, to those schools to get the scholarship, that kind of stuff. So there's always something that block it. Um, and then um, finally, after a couple of years, I got job. After those couple of years, I got a job in this small company. It's kind of like a vendor of a bigger company. So I worked there for a couple of years, and then they were asking like if I want to come to Hong Kong as a, you know, as a base in Hong Kong rather than like go back and forth because our client here sometimes I got sent here for a couple of weeks for a month and so, and then after that I was like, yes. I mean, Hong Kong is not my first choice. Um, I always want to go to Europe um, or Korea or Japan in that sense. Like Korea is my number one, Europe is my number two. So I always want to go to those countries, but you know what? Hong Kong is not that bad. And then I have a friend here who already based here in Hong Kong. So I'm not gonna be alone. And it's only four hours from Malaysia. And I was like, why not? I'll take. I'll take it and then finally when I got here I feel like my life is actually started like I was lost and waiting for things to happen from when I finished my study um, my degree study until I moved here that was like around four to five years I feel like nothing is happening um, things doesn't go my way and even though I was putting some effort, I'm majority of the time I was waiting. I was waiting for someone to come and help me. I was waiting for things to happen. I was waiting. And then until that moment, I was like, click that I cannot read anymore. I have to make something out of 
anything so that's when I got here and then I got here it's such a big leap of faith that like I'm just gonna leave everything behind um, I don't have much money at the same at that time but I was I was like I was determined to make things happen for me so I did right it makes me realize that like yes good thing happened for those two who wait but at the same time you cannot just wait and wait you have to work on it if you are lucky things happen for you so easily lucky for you but I'm someone who nothing being handed out for me it's like money good things everything I have to work it on my own from there on it makes me realize that oh if I want something I have to work for it if something is handed for me of course I'll take it I'm grateful for it but most of the times things are not get handed right um, the promotion that you want the high increment that you want the travel that you want to go all of those things has to either you got the opportunity or you need to ask for it if you need to ask for it then you have to talk about it right talk to your manager talk to your friends if you want to travel and then sometimes even about traveling at my age um, all of my friends either married with kids or they have their own life so I don't have many friends that can travel with me so whenever I want to go somewhere I want to do something I just have to do it I just have to go I have I just have to go and make it happen so, yeah. but it doesn't mean that I'm just gonna go how to say like if I will still extend my invitation to my friends like hey do you want to go here if they don't want then I will just let them so Mary Robbins did apply the um, let them theory which is I think it helps a lot as well because sometimes I feel a bit a bit behind and left out because my friends have a different life they have like they have they are married with kids and I am not but I have other life that I'm living at the same time right so if they are too busy to hang out with me let them if someone goes somewhere without me let them so I am applying that theory uh, to my life as well and it helps it helps and I hope it will help you if you you know are in the same situation as me if people want to do what they want to do let them if the things happen the way it is, the way it is you want to happen let them the only thing that I can do is um, or I can control is my my attitude my actions and my response to whatever happening so rather than being sad and um, depressed about my situations I'm determined to make the best out of it and I will travel whenever I am um, whatever I can so I am grateful that I am lucky that I have the money to travel when I want where I want to of course to make a big travel you have more you need to have more um, planning and stuff but like from Hong Kong if I want to go to Taiwan if I want to go to um, Thailand if I want to go to Korea and Japan it's just like two three hours radius from Hong Kong so I can just buy a ticket and go you know I don't have to think too much about it I don't have to think too hard about it I am lucky that I can do it so I'm gonna do it I'm gonna live the life of my life for me I'm gonna live the life for me and um, if someone come along and want to join I will welcome them if they decided not to come they can you know that's their choice if they decided not to have me in their life that's your choice I will let them be um, I'm just gonna be my life because you have to think that if something happened to you tomorrow let's say you die tomorrow and you was like why didn't I do that you always regret for the things that you didn't do rather than you did at least you tried and you know it's not working then you can just like let that happen but in a sense you know um, you have to try so this is one of the things that I'm trying um, I would like to talk to people have my own community that kind of stuff so um, this is where I'm gonna put my effort and my energy in if it works if it doesn't work it's fine um, I'm still gonna put it in and just enjoy myself that's that so 
this is my reminder for you and for me of course if you want something go for it make it happen if you want that opportunity create it for you you know of course sometimes you need people to open the door if they open the door for you it will be easier that would be nice but if not do it for yourself if you think there's no one helping you help yourself be there for yourself be a reliable person that you can be for yourself right and that's that i'm your friends if you want to talk about something let me know um, reach out to me from the email and stuff um my instagram i'll start i will gonna i'm gonna start to post more on instagram um, to revive it i haven't done it in a bit, in a bit. i i'm just a lot of things had happened um, but I've decided like you know what life happened anyway I'm still gonna do it so I'm gonna rewrite my Instagram and I'm hoping to post every day or every other day so I'm gonna put like my handle here um, and you know reach out to me on Instagram if you want to chat if you want to visit Hong Kong maybe like if you need anything um, some recommendation I'll do a video about it like where you should go and stuff uh, <laughs> yeah that's all um, I hope you enjoyed this video I'll see you in the next video guys thank you for watching bye